I have a love-hate relationship with fireworks because we do have that fire danger out there, but they're really fun. So maybe leave it to the pros and go to a show. I right. don't know. That's <laughs> yeah, the best that's idea. Yeah. That's advice. You know, yeah. you, get, you get the biggest fireworks at those shows. So uh, try and enjoy that. But just do be safe. We do have the holiday coming up in a week or so, two weeks there until we uh, hit the fourth. So it's coming up. Uh, as we look into our first week of summertime, we are looking at some wet weather. We're watching the system well offshore here. It's churning away and going to push some cold air into our region along with some moisture. So we are looking at more rain as we head towards our Wednesday afternoon and the chance for some thunderstorms uh, there too. But currently we're seeing a nice little patch of some light rain working from the south uh, northward here towards Vancouver. So likely some wet areas, but overall we are mainly cloudy out in Portland and a bit more sunny further south. Right now 66 degrees in Portland with mostly cloudy skies. A bit gloomy out there, but not bad. Low 60s out towards Stoller Winery where we are seeing a bit more sunshine there. More sun breaks. 70 degrees out towards the gorge. We're looking mostly sunny there. And out towards the coast, Lincoln City, a bit cloudy. Some spots along the coast uh, are seeing more sunshine. So we're getting hit or miss clouds and some hit or miss drizzle there uh, for the afternoon so far. So here's our future cast. Going into the rest of our afternoon and evening, we'll still keep a chance for some spotty showers around. Again, mainly dry up and down the valley, but towards the coast, the higher elevations, uh, we may see a pop up shower and pretty heavy at that. Going into our Wednesday, we start off mainly dry. Dry, but by the afternoon, we see that next pulse of moisture and some instability uh, that will maybe pop up some thunderstorms as we head towards our afternoon and evening. So we're watching out for that. It's the cold air that's really doing that. So as we work our way towards the afternoon tomorrow and also for our Thursday, uh, we'll see more widespread rain and also the chance for some thunderstorms. That rain also lingers into Friday and the start of Saturday before we do dry up. Here again is the look at where we may see thunderstorms for tomorrow. Everywhere in green here, that's up and down the valley towards the foothills. Uh, there's a chance for a pop up heavy shower and even thunderstorm and uh, further northeast there in Oregon, a better chance out towards the foothills of the blues and also the Wallow Mountains. So here's our forecast for today. The coast will top off in the 60s today. We'll get a mix of clouds and sun, some passing showers still possible in Portland today. We'll top off in the low to mid 70s today with an isolated shower. Better chance of that this evening. Mostly sunny out eastward. We'll see temperatures in the 70s and in the gorge. We'll keep it mostly sunny too uh, with temperatures in the upper 70s. Still a bit gusty there with winds around 20 miles per hour. So here's our seven day forecast. Tomorrow through Friday, we reintroduce some more wet weather, uh, especially for the afternoon. We'll see some pop up heavy showers and even the potential for thunderstorms as we start to decrease our temperatures towards the upper 60s. So a little bit cooler, but by the weekend, still looking to shape up nicely. Uh, we'll close in on 80 degrees there by Sunday. And yeah, mm -hmm. we really need the rain, too. We do. We are well below average here in June, so all the rain we can get is a good thing. Yeah. Okay. All right. Thanks, Kelly. We'll be right back.